Hello guys, in this video we will see how to download and install Ubuntu Linux 24.04.3 desktop edition on VirtualBox. First go to Ubuntu official website and download. Go to release releases.ubuntu.com See here the latest release is 24.04.3 LTS version. Click on it. See here we have desktop image, server install image and other options. I am going to download desktop image so click on the 64 bit desktop image no need to register see download started go to download see here its size is about 5.9 gigabytes i'm cancelling this one because i have already downloaded see here i have already downloaded ubuntu 24.04.3 desktop iso image in your case wait until download completes once download is completed then open virtual box if you haven't installed virtual box then search for my youtube channel how to install virtual box on windows or linux operating system so open it Then click on new or machine and select new. Both are same to create new virtual machine. Provide the name for the virtual machine. UBD. This is just virtual machine. Name can be anything. Then select the folder to store this virtual machine files and folders. This is the default location. If you want some other location, then select other. Then select the path. Here you have the NOS space or as per your requirement. Then select the downloaded ISV image. Click on other. Then go to download. See here we have the ISV image. Select it. Then see once you selected, type change it to Linux. Sub type to Ubuntu version as Ubuntu 64 bit. Select the checkbox. Skip unattended in installation. Then go to hardware. See by default memory selected 2 gigabytes. I am giving 4 gigabytes. Number of CPU equals to hard disk. I am giving 50 gigabytes. It is up to you. Then click on finish. Still, you want to modify the settings of this virtual machine, right click and select settings or just select from this left menu and click on the settings or select it and go to machine and settings. All three options are same. If I work with all the settings, then click on start. Use up and down arrows and select the first one that is try or install Ubuntu and hit enter. See if cursor is grayed out, just press alt control to release the cursor. Now select the language and click on next. Next, select keyboard layout. I am going with the default, then click on next. Connect to the internet. See here we have two options. Use wide connection or don't connect to the internet. It is up to you. I want to connect. Then select next. See here we have the two options. Install Ubuntu or try Ubuntu. Install Ubuntu is permanent. Try Ubuntu is just for testing purpose. I want to install install Ubuntu for permanent. So Select install Ubuntu and click on next. See here type of installation, automated installation or interactive installation. I am going with interactive installation. Then click on next. Application selection, I am going with the defaults. Next. If you want to install that party software for graphics and Wi-Fi hardware, you have to select the checkbox. And if you want to download and install support for additional media formats, you have to select the checkbox. Okay. I don't want. Next. Disk setup. See, this is a fresh installation, so I am going to select Erase Disk and install Ubuntu. Then click on Next. Now we have to create our setup username. I am giving user name as R2 Scus. This is the user full name, this is the computer name, and this is the user name. Okay. So I am giving computer name as UB24043VM. Then provide the password for this user. Confirm the same. If you have a Active Directory, select use Active Directory, I don't have, so click on Next, select the region or time zone, you can select from this, you can search from here and select, or you can click on this globe, then click on Next, I am going with the defaults, see these are the choices that we have selected for the Ubuntu operating system, if you want to modify any one of them, you have to go to back and you can edit, if you are okay with all the settings, then click on Install. See installation has been started, this will take time, I am going to pause the video until installation completes. See installation is completed, click on restart now. See 
see here the message please remove the installation media then press enter okay alt control to re release the cursor then go to virtual box then see here nav to kill drive it is empty if it is not empty click on it and remove disk from the virtual drive okay so it is already removed so go to here and hit enter now it is rebooting Click on username and provide the password. If you want to see the release notes, click on view release notes, then click on next. If you want to enable Ubuntu Pro, you have to select this one. Otherwise, select this skip for now and click on skip. And then share system data with Ubuntu team. Select it next. Finish. All done. Now open terminal go to show applications see here if you have the terminal open it then we pay the version that have shall more slash etc os hyphen release see we have installed ubuntu 24.04.3 lts noble number okay the first step after connecting to ubuntu is we have to update the package sudo apt update ampersand ampersand sudo apt upgrade hit enter provide the password of sudo user hit enter See all packages are updated. Control A. Okay. So in this video we have seen how to download and install Ubuntu 24.04.3 LTS desktop version on virtual box. Okay. For more tutorials, please subscribe my channel. Thank you.